Hi everybody, it's Record Store Day 2019, the new Paul McCartney single's out, Home Tonight in a Hurry. I'm going to show you exactly how this looks and I'm also going to do a bit of a sound test for you with it being a picture disc. We'll see whether there's any uh, noise that you sometimes associate with those. So these two singles have been out for a week now digitally and I've had a chance to listen to them quite a few times and what am I thinking so far? Well, Home Tonight... Um, is a good song it's a good pleasant song I, I'm, I'm not really fussed about it being on Egypt station so I'm, I'm I'm glad that it wasn't on there I think it's nice to have it as a separate track the interesting one for me is in a hurry now I think it's definitely the better of the two songs and I've been trying to think about why it might have been left off Egypt station and I wonder whether there's sort of similarities to despite repeated warnings in the way that it goes through different phases and builds up and I just wonder whether there wasn't room for both of them on the album. Maybe they thought maybe you thought you couldn't have two songs sort of quite similar in structure together. And despite repeated warnings, is a bit of an epic. I think it's a it's a far better song. As much as I like "In a Hurry," uh, despite despite repeated warnings, was definitely the one to put on the album. Uh, but but it's a really nice song, and I love the sort of interplay between his lead vocals and the backing vocals. How they sort of trade off each other. It's really nice. It almost reminds me a little bit of. Um, um, Dear Boy from Ram, the way that they they sort of they, they work together. It's a really nice song. Anyway, anyway, to the single. I'm going to show you some real good close up photos as we go along of what we've got here. But I was uh, I was in town first thing this morning when they opened at eight o'clock to get this. Let's show you the back first of all. Paul McCartney, Home Tonight in a hurry. Like I say, I'm going to give you um, a good photograph close up of all of this. It's in a nice thick plastic sleeve. Uh, there's the front of it there, but again, I'll give you uh, I'll give you good photographs of all this. So we've got the record store day Black Friday label there, and uh, <clears throat> I do like this picture disc with the, uh, the the game on there. It's like the old fashioned game of um, you know sort of spinning around the different dials to make up different uh, hideous bodies. But let's open this up anyway and have a look. Yeah, it's a nice thick piece of plastic, is that? Um, that's out it comes. I'll show you that in a second. First of all, you can see that there's the lyrics to both songs in there. This is a sticker that's over the top of it. So it'll be interesting to just see what happens if I... Does this easily pull out? Let's have a look. It does. So let's take that out. So you can see that sticker there. And then this is just a plain piece of card with those lyrics, that side and the sort of credits on the back there but again I'll give you some photographs of that in a moment but let's have a look at the disc itself so this to me looks like it's side A with that A in the middle there looks very nice we'll see how it plays in a bit I'm going to put it on the record player and uh, we're going to see how it how it plays now that says AA which I assume is side B is it the same pictures I don't know let's have a look I think it is the same pictures on both sides. One thing's one thing that's quite interesting to me, and I don't know whether the camera's going to be able to pick this up. I'll see if I can pick it up on the photographs. Is that right in the centre there? It looks really scratched. I don't think it's scratched on the actual playing part itself, but right in the middle on that uh, that sort of inner circle, it looks really scratched to me. Um, I don't think it's a problem. Uh, but we'll find out. Anyway, we'll find out. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to move over to the record player. And I can't play the records because this video will get taken straight down. But what I can do is I can put the needle on the on the outside. And we're just going to sort of have a bit of a test of what kind of surface noise it's picking up with it being a picture disc. I'm digging you. So have you been enjoying these two songs over the last week? Let me know your thoughts on them. And also, are you picking up this picture disc? Have you got it today? Are you hoping to get it sometime? I don't know how many copies are available, so I don't know how easy it's going to be to get hold of. Uh, but yeah, let me know. And if you like this kind of thing, then please subscribe to my channel. I would love to see you on future videos. But uh, thank you very much for watching. See you again. Bye-bye.